Nice to be in you by video. My name is Eung Lee and I am the president of Chungnam Techno Park. In Korea, there are 19 techno parks. Chungnam Techno Park is one of them. Geometrically, Chungnam is located at the center of Korea. If you had a chance to visit Korea, please step by Chungnam Techno Park. I will serve you a nice Korean food like bulgogi, kimchi, and so on. Nice meeting you here, and I hope you enjoy these presentations. Today, I prepared three presentations. The first presentation is about business supporting policy initiatives of Korea STP. STP means Science and Technology Park. The second and the third presentations are about new trend of industrial paradigm. The second one is about the fourth industrial revolutions and its core technologies in perspectives of case and role of techno park. And the third one is about Korea's New Deal policies and related businesses. I think you who will see this video might be a leader to make policies or to act plans for your country. I hope my presentations will give you some inspiration and clues for developing industries in your country. And you will be a cornerstone of industry development for your country. Welcome to my presentation and uh, nice to meet you by this video like this. The title of today's presentation is Business Supporting Policy Initiatives of Korea STP. Here is my name. My name is Eung Lee and I'm the CEO of Chungnam Techno Park. In Korea, there are 19 techno parks. My Chungnam Techno Park is one of them. Let's begin this today's session. This page shows the list of index. First, what is STP? And then I will explain definition and types of STPs. And then I will show you development process of Korea Techno Parks for steps and the PDCA process at Korea Techno Park and the regional strategic industries. Last chapter, uh, there is six main businesses of STPs. And this page shows you what is STP. Um, IASP defines key terms of STP like this. STP is an organization managed by specialized professionals whose main aim is to increase the wealth of its community by promoting the culture of innovation and the competitiveness of its associated businesses and knowledge-based institutions. That's the definition of STP. Uh, in the view of organizational perspectives, profession professionals to lead technological upgrading and to plan regional sustainable development. In the view of spatial perspectives, innovational hub to promote networking amongst universities, enterprises, and on research institutions to maintain industrial self-sustaining ecosystem rather than just the clustering. Cluster and ecosystem, the two 
Terms are often used synonymously in relation to regional innovation. A cluster is generally understood to mean a group of innovation actors in a specific industry, clustering of key locations. One example of such a site is Volksburg, a city of northern German. Since the 1930s, it has been the site of the Volkswagen Group's main plant, as planned on the drawing board. Today, numerous suppliers, companies, has settled here and more than 100,000 people work in the automotive and the supplier industries. In this case, everyone depends on one player. Ecosystem stresses a completely different structure. A network of many different players. In an ecosystem, all the players interact with each other in one way or another in a self-organizing environment. In this case, everyone depends on everyone else. Such an ecosystem is robust and resilient precisely because there is no one dominant player and because it has the flexibility to better process internal dice functions as well as external shocks. And what is more, it can also work on smaller scales. That's why Korean Techno Park's emphasis ecosystem, which is a rather chemical and dynamic structure than physical, densified in a certain location. In this page, let me show you definitions of types of STPs. The presentation example of Science Research Park is Stanford Research Park at Palo Alto in the USA. Stanford Research Park draws groundbreaking startups, established R&D companies, and the search branches of Fortune 500 companies to community of innovation with access to research and talented from nearby Stanford University. Well-known companies uh, such as Shure Packard, Tesla Motors, Apple were housed. It has been called an engine for Silicon Valley. The Hinsu Science Park is now one of the world's most significant centers for semiconductor manufacturing, industrial, and computer technology development. More than 400 high-tech companies, mainly involved in the semiconductor, telecommunication, and optoelectric industries have been established since the 2003. Its 400 technology companies such as TSMC, UMC, and more accounted for 10% of Taiwan's GDP. The Hinju Science Park is located nearby Industrial Technology Research Institute, two of Taiwan's science and engineering powerhouses, National Chiao Tung University and the National Tsinghua University and the National Space Organization. The Taiwanese Space Agency is located in the park. 
there is also a science-themed amusement park nearby. In this page, uh, there are definitions of types of STP. Um, there are some functions of um, uh, institute, some functions like this, educational training, research transfer, research development, startup business, industrial production, and living culture. And with the traditional concepts, university has a educational training function like this. And uh, industrial part has uh, some function of industrial production, manufacturing. So another um, system like research center. Research center has uh, two functions in this definition like this. Research centers has research transfer function and research development function. And uh, like Technology Park here, Technology Park has uh, some more functions from here to there. I think you can see in this table uh, like this. So more bigger concept of technology, po uh, technopolis and innovation ecosystems have all of functions in this table. Now I will show you development process of Korea Techno Park. Four steps. Korea is a well-known case of successful catching up. But as you know, the catching up has not been translated into equal opportunities for our provinces in Korea. It is the main reason for the creation of Korean techno parks across the country. Korean techno parks are considered a tool for supporting competitiveness in regions. The birth of regional development policy in Korea was as usually happens associated with the attempt by central government to development program in specific reason. From the 1998, the central government started to implement a specific program to target regional development. Launching growth required deepening the industrial transformation and supporting specialization in knowledge-intensive industries so that Techno Park was introduced as an innovation hub to proceed all the procedures needed. The timelines was shown here. In this page, I will explain the PDCA process at Korea Techno Park. This is a kind of uh, walking procedure like this. PDCA is uh, are the initials of uh, those words. Plan, do, check, adjust. In this stage of plan, we make policy planning like this. Provide industrial growth strategy, considering industrial structure and uh, natural resources in a region. And then at the next stage of do, here we make business supporting work. We support SMEs. S you know, SME means small and medium enterprises. 
So our Techno Park support SME's research and development and support pilot manufacturing and post BI information delivery and equipment supporting and training and HR linked to work. Korea Techno Parks supports like this. And the third stage of check. In this stage, Techno Park analyzes strategic figures of regional growth, like this SME's revenue and employment growth and the value added effect. And the last stage of adjust. In this stage, Technoparks adapt business model to figure out the advantages and the factors for differentiation aside from standardization. Technopark designs the framework to support the strategic industries. A specific program for lagging areas was implemented. In the earlier stage of revitalization business program targeted agriculture dependent area and supports processing and distribution linkages to support development area. There are 19 techno parks across the country like this. All, te all techno parks has its own strategic industries which are selected in consideration of its regional resources and industrial structure. For example, let's see the Chungnam province here. Chungnam is here. Chungnam has faced reason as one of Korea's three major export strongholds. For your reference, Chungnam Techno Park is selected as one of six pilot techno parks in 1998. The pink color shows the six pilot techno parks in this figure. The driving force behind the regional export is major leading companies in the field of electronics and automobile. Samsung Electronics moved its LCD headquarters into the region. Meanwhile, Samsung SDI, Samsung Koning, and the Samsung Electronics Semiconductors plants are all located in the region and consist clustering. There are as many as 116 display companies accounting for about 50% of Korea's display businesses and driving the exports of the region. Hyundai making its entry into world's top five automotive companies establishes approximately 5 million vehicles per year worldwide production system. The manufac manufacturing facility is fully independent equipped with a 300,000 per year mid and full size passenger car production plant along with an engine and parts plant. Moreover, the agriculture has developed mainly regarding rice, livestock, and fruit production. That is why Chungnam province presents its strategic industries as automobile, electronic, and agricultural bio. Now, let me show you six main businesses of Technopark. Regional 
strategic industries has been established in 19 metropolitan cities and provinces. The pre previous slide shows the location of priority industries in each area. However, regardless its distinct characteristic in industrial fields, every techno park has the same main businesses to support SMEs. First one is uh, common equipment. That is uh, one of six main businesses. Due to regional specialized fields of industry, common equipment can be required 30 to 40% of total budget will be solely spent for buying high-tech equipment in order to share with res residential SMEs. Equipment shall be selected depending on technological demands of SMEs and pass through multi-stages of validation. CTP here. CTP means my Chungnam Techno Park. We have 342 machines and supports to SME over 400 cases in testing, analyzing, and pilot production. And another, we have CLAS. CLAS means Korea Laboratory Accreditation. CLAS's certificate for assessment procedures to promote qualitative enhancement. CTP runs CLAS in the industrial fields of display and automobile. In 2019, it acquires public display accreditation. And here are one example of industry. John Cosmetic is a company in Chungnam. We support this company like this. Um, we provide manufacturing prototype product and supporting ample injector applicator product. So in the result, this company acquires a patent for lifting, whitening, and retain moisture effect cosmetic compositions. So sales, sales increased by 186% over last year. Wow, great. <laughs> we support like this. And next, the second business is post-business incubation. Business incubation are occurred at universities focusing on idea to be more concrete for commercialization. Post-business incubation at Techno Park mainly aimed to technological commercializations, including pilot level of production. And uh, here are some stages. Okay, first stage, someone has an idea, and then with the idea, we develop some concepts, and then we need technological upgrading and commercialization. And finally, we have to make product to sale. So every stage, CTP helps and supports for industries. Here's another example, Korea Automation Technology is, a, is an industry of Chungna. This company made 
like this automobile parts semiconductor. We support R&D for dual clamp prototyping, including redesign, vibration te testing, and coating processes. So result in result here, it, this company acquired the patent for clamp. So sales was increased by 145% of last year, like this. And the third of main businesses is here, education and HR linked to work. Chungnam has a high density of manufacturing enterprises, mainly focusing on heavy industries such as automobile and display. CTP searches for blue chip companies in region, selects them as member companies after making an agreement of recruitment. In the meantime, Joint Education Center is running a long-term technological course to cultivate skilled individuals. So the average period to complete a course is two to three months and the trainees are obliged to take a contest to qualify their skills and invented products. CTP's JEC program shows over 70% recruiting success rate. Courses students to workplace linkages. I think uh, this percentage is great for recruiting. And the first main business is here, joint research and development. CTP takes a leading role to plan government-sponsored research and development project and involved to execute it. The R&D consortium often regards a promising means for pursuing development projects. Through public-private R&D consortium, manufacturers, small and medium businesses, universities, national laboratories, and the state, and the local government are brought together in push coordinated yearly state R&D in high priority area essentials. Here are some examples. We are researching about second battery management system and fuel cell electric vehicle and the next display OLED. Here are these uh, tables shows you the budgets like this. So B. <laughs> and let's move to the fifth main business here, networking. Korean Techno Park is a network hub for local industry, academia, research institutes, and the governmental body, like this. So CTP opened the Open in a Cafe, an open sp special platform in 2019, which acts on innovation hub to provide the consulting service by professionals and the crowding sources for supporting policies upon SMEs need. Some pictures show the results. I want to show you this concept of open innovation for technology transfer. For last decade, new product re replaced 50% of total revenue is the field of automobile and pharmaceutical and electronic commodities. Here, 
rate of failure surpasses than rate of success. Only one project survives out of 3,000 raw ideas. Only 30 to 60 percent of projects make profits after introducing on shelves. Here's an example of technology transfer and mediation to reduce the failure risk and shorten the period of development. You know, 777 is a manufacturer of nail clipper with notable technology on pressing and molding processes. It has 40% share in worldwide market. This company is trying to enhance anti-forgery features. So 777 and Korea minting and security printing is com all of technological concepts are combined. So this company maintains worldwide market shares like this. The six main business of uh, six main businesses, that means last <laughs> business model is that integrated business support. In general, SMEs are suffering a lack of experience in marketing and lack of knowledge of exporting. CTP, Chungnam Techno Park, acts like a catalyst for bridging between SMEs and overseas customers and suppliers. There are several examples. In marketing, we made collaboration with World Okta. Okta means Overseas Korean Traders Association. CTP provides export consulting and supports to find customers and agencies. And in exhibition, CTP helps SMEs to participate local and overseas exhibition. In financing area, CTP supports to link potential SMEs and startups to venture capital as well as to hold IR meetings and conference to introduce technologies. The first chapter deals with Korean techno parks and roles to support regional developments and bring up entrepreneurship in order to accomplish sustainable growth. That's all the presentation I prepared for it. I will see you the next session. Finally, there are two quiz here. First quiz is here. What is the term which indicates the practice of businesses sourcing ideas from the external, such as technology transfer? I think you can remember the answer. If you could not remember, you can find the answer in the internet, like Google and Yahoo. And uh, let me move to the second quiz. The quiz is, which is the proper formation of collaboration for government-sponsored R&D project? There are some examples here. First, independent R&D, second, merge and acquisition, third, public-private consortium. Can you pick one for the answer? Now is the end. Thank you for attention.